opening with the king's pawn controls the center and opens up the light squared bishop and queen, often leading to sharp games. The Sicilian defense controls the d4 square with c-pawn. Nf3 develops the knight toward the center to prepare for a d4 pawn push, where the knight will recapture if black captures on d4. g6 prepares to fianchetto the dark squared bishop, where it will sit on the long diagonal. c3 controls the d4 and b4 squares and prepares the d4 pawn push. This threatens to win a pawn. It is the last book move. This defends the attacked pawn. It is good. This blocks the check from an opposing queen. It is best. This move puts the queen on a safer square. It is best. This kicks an opposing queen. It is best. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. It is best. This defends the attacked pawn. It is good. This is an equal trade. It is best. Takes back. It is best. This prepares the bishop for development. It is best. This ignores an opportunity to develop a queen off its starting square. It is an inaccuracy. This misses a better way to recapture a piece. It is a mistake. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. It is best. This develops a bishop off its starting square getting it into the action. It is excellent. This fianchettos the bishop by placing it on a powerful diagonal. It is good. This is the strongest option. It is best. This overlooks an opportunity to evade the check from the opposing queen. It is an inaccuracy. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. Takes back. It is forced. This develops a bishop off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is good. This takes an open file, a common method for activating a rook. This threatens to reveal a check. It is best. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling kingside tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. It is best. A solid choice. It is excellent. The rooks can see each other now, allowing them to provide mutual defense. It is good. A very strong play. It is excellent. One of the best moves. It is excellent. This adds pressure by pinning a knight. It is good. That's not a mistake, but it's not the best move either. It is good. The rooks can see each other now allowing them to provide mutual defense. It is excellent. The opposing bishop is kicked by a pawn, and must now move or be captured. It is excellent. This forces doubled pawns in front of the opponent's king, decreasing its safety and harming the pawn structure. It is best. Recaptures. It is best. This misses an opportunity to develop a rook off its starting square. It is an inaccuracy. This allows the knight to control more squares. It is excellent. This threatens to fork pieces. It is an inaccuracy. This defends the attacked pawn. This stops the opponent from being able to fork pieces. It is best. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. The opposing knight is kicked by a pawn, and must now move or be captured. It is good. This moves the knight to safety. It is best. Right on target. It is best. This reveals an attack on a pawn. It is best. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. It is best. This moves the bishop to a better location, allowing it to control more squares. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This attacks a knight, winning a tempo when it moves away. It is good. This protects the attacked pawn. It is best. This evades the check from the knight. It is best. This defends the attacked knight. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. This threatens to win a knight. It is good. This is an equal trade. 
This is the only move that works. It is best. Takes back. It is best. This activates a rook by developing it off of its starting square. It is excellent. The opposing bishop is kicked by a pawn, and must now move or be captured. It is good. This moves the bishop to safety. It is excellent. This overlooks an opportunity to threaten winning a pawn. It is an inaccuracy. Very precise. It is best. This wins material. It is good. This defends a vulnerable pawn by pinning one of its attackers. This threatens to create a passed pawn. It is good. This exposes an attack, threatening a pawn. It is best. This overlooks an opportunity to capture a pawn that was threatening to win material. It is a mistake. White had an advantage, but now the game is close to equal. It is an inaccuracy. This is the only good move. It is a great move. Recaptures. This threatens to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is best. This is the strongest option. It is best. This leaves a pawn without defenders. It is an inaccuracy. That was a free pawn. It is best. This pushes a passed pawn. This threatens to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is good. This threatens to win a bishop. It is an inaccuracy. This stops the opponent from being able to win a bishop. It is excellent. This steps away from the checking bishop. It is best. This is an equal trade. It is best. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. This is the start of the end game and black is equal. It is best. This is an equal trade. It is good. After all captures, this is an equal trade. It is excellent. This is an equal trade. It is best. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. This moves the knight to safety. It is excellent. This moves the bishop to a more active square, making it gain scope. It is best. This evades the check from the bishop. It is best. This pins a knight to the king. It is good. This kicks an opposing bishop. It is good. This moves the bishop to safety. It is good. This offers an equal trade of pieces. It is excellent. This move puts the bishop on a safer square. It is excellent. That's a sensible reply. It is excellent. Right on target. It is best. This steps away from the checking bishop. It is best. Very precise. It is best. This is the strongest option. It is best. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. This is a fair move. It is good. This threatens to win a pawn. It is excellent. This defends the attacked pawn. This is the only good move. This stops the opponent from being able to win a pawn. It is a great move. A solid choice. It is excellent. This steps away from the checking bishop. It is excellent. An active king is critical in the end game and getting it off of the back rank is the first step. It is good. A very strong play. It is excellent. This moves the bishop to safety. It is best. This threatens to win a bishop. It is good. This prevents the opponent from being able to win a bishop. It is best. This moves the bishop to a better location, allowing it to control more squares. It is excellent. Right on target. It is best. Very precise. It is best. This is the strongest option. It is best. That's fine. It is good. This ignores a better way to evade the check from the opposing bishop. It is an inaccuracy. This is not the right idea. It is an inaccuracy. There was only one good move there. It is a mistake. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This threatens to create a passed pawn. It is best. This makes a passed pawn, 
meaning no opposing pawn can challenge it on its way to promotion. It is best. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. The passed pawn moves towards its goal. This threatens to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is best. After all captures, this is an equal trade. This stops the opponent from being able to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is best. This is an equal trade. It is best. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. Takes back. It is best. Right on target. It is best. Balanced neither player ever had an advantage. That game was pretty competitive. The opening was balanced. That was an incredible middle game by both players. Both players had incredible precision in the end game.